what to do with those old t-shirts you don't wear anymore? Let me give you a couple of ideas. So I have a lot of t-shirts that I just don't wear anymore. This one, Slime Slinger, that's from a slime fun run. And I got to be one of the people that threw slime at people. <laughs> it was kind of fun. Uh, maybe not the most well organized, but pretty fun. Anyway, so I've got this pillow, which has a cute design, but it's kind of looking a little dingy. It bled a little from washing and just, I don't know. I thought it'd be fun to cover it with this. So I'm trying to get the biggest area possible that will fit this shape. And I actually have two of these shirts. Obviously, you're not always going to have two. Uh, I could have used the other side for the back or a different shirt. I think it'd actually be really fun to have different colors. Um, for when you do the next part. So I put them face together, kind of sandwiched so that the slits align. And I'm just gonna do even sizing and around the edges. I just tie one kind of in the middle of each side so it really centers it, so it's not pulling too much one way or another. And then you are gonna go around and tie it all up. It's pretty simple and I think it's fun. This is a really fun idea, in particular, if you have a logo you wanna save, some t-shirts that are gonna be plain or have stains. Um, I'm gonna come out with video at another time with those, but if you wanna preserve it in this way, you don't wanna do like a whole t-shirt blanket, which is really complicated, <laughs> this is a fun no-sew project. Let me know what you think. Next up, this is not technically a t-shirt, I guess. I got this from Wish on my vlog channel. I've done some Wish hauls, but this, it fit weird. The quality of fabric is horrible, but you know, the picture is cute and I didn't want to figure out a return. So <laughs> I just took an old frame that I have and took out the cardboard in there as a template. Um, it took me a little while to figure out exactly what I needed to do. It's a little bit thicker because it's more of a sweatshirt kind of so it wasn't so easy just to tape it down but in you know, a little finagling trying to decide how to debulk it so it's not just like jam-packed in there and just a fun little piece of wall art obviously you need a frame that matches the size of the logo you want to preserve but this is just a fun idea let me know if you are interested in other ideas um, because i have a whole bunch of them other things that i've done before but I just wanted to show these because there's so many like sentimental shirts that I know I have and fun shirts with different logos and you can turn them into art or pillows. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining me here on Jen's Creativity Corner. Please make sure to give that a little subscribe up above. Um, I am trying to get to 2,000 subscribers and doing a giveaway and just a thumbs up helps me as well. I appreciate that. And any comments, what do you think of this idea? If you are interested in Wish hauls, I actually bought some things on Wish specifically for this channel, crafting and cooking. Just have not gotten around to it. Let me know if you're interested in that and I'll try to get around to it sooner than later. And in the meantime, go ahead and watch some fun ones on my vlog channel. I always list my vlog channel down below. And I hope you all have a wonderful day. Thanks for watching.